For this film, we always knew what we need to say, which was clear in the script given to us. Question was, how to say it? How to create new visual space? A visual space that one has never seen. How to pitch the film so that it does not sound like a high-handed history lesson? How to be casually authoritative? We knew Ranbir was going to take a journey from the past historic moments to the recent times. At that point, we had many unanswered questions. Should we have the relevant video footage pop up as Ranbir talks about them? It looked too obvious a solution. Can we project the photographs of the events in huge screens? How about making the projected image and the narrator interact? Something like this professor is trying. Over here. <laughs> okay, good. First of all, okay. So let's see what would happen if we start with this equation right here. <laughs> or should Ranbi just walk through video projections of the news events he's talking about? Can we shoot it? We did a small test shoot, something like this. Launched us into space, and a creative genius won us an Oscar. Or should we use CG like this? One of the main questions was, should we create the film with video clips or still images? After a discussion with the creative director, we decided that still images are more relatable to the newspaper than video footage. Should Ranveer walk between huge projection screens, projecting still images of the news events? We created a concept art to check it. Not really excited by it, we came up with a new idea. Can we use larger than life Times of India newspaper instead of projection screens? These will hang from high ceilings of a massive factory. Shafts of light from the glass window will illuminate the space. Ranbir will walk around them. We tried out a rough Photoshop version to brief the artist. This is how the final space looked like. Looking at the visual, we came up with an idea of hanging the newspaper in two rows. We arranged the old editions to recent ones from back to front so that it will visually bring out the concept of passage of time. Better still, it will create an alley of time through which Ranbir will walk. We then decided to hang huge blank newsprints and project the image of the newspaper on it. It allowed us to create some interesting transitions. The background plates were shot in a factory without Ranbir Kapoor. All the lenses, camera height, camera movement, lighting design were noted down as we needed to replicate the same while shooting with Ranbir at a later date. We did not use any motion control camera for this film. Before shooting, the script was rewritten again to change the pitch of the performance, to make it more friendly. For instance, it was just 20 years before 1857 uprising that kindled the first flames of freedom in the heart of a nation that had not begun to exist, became. Okay, let's see. It was 20 years before 1857. 1857, dude, apna original azadi ki uprising. Okay, let's see. It was 20 years before 1857? 1857, dude. Up to original Azadi ki uprising. We created the environment with CG newspaper, with all the lighting and the movements matched. Each shot is created with multiple passes to make it look real. Here is the final film. 1838, 175 years, 175 saal. That's not very, very long ago. No? Okay, let's see. It was 20 years before 1857? 1857, dude. Apni original azadi ki uprising. 
and it was what around uh, 100 years before our independence freedom at midnight remember yaar sach mein 175 years is really not that long ago it was just about 145 years before we won our first world cup made our first trip to space and got world recognition for our cinema it was also just 160 years before the world's largest democracy became its youngest superpower and fairy tales began turning into dreams dreams became ambitions and those ambitions turned into millions of people like me it also took 175 years for a new india to emerge a new india that has finally found the courage to look deep into its heart to face the dark reality that haunts its soul and also shows us the promise of an india that we all hope to be a part of yep 175 years back it's not really a long time ago actually it seems like just another day in the life of india